Hey guys, it's me Ryan and welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video I just wanted to really sit down and give you all an update um, because I have a few things going on um, that I want to update you guys on. It's really positive, there's <laughs> nothing negative um, and yeah I just want to sit down and really talk to you guys because I feel like I haven't done that in a while. Um, my videos are normally tutorials or I'm always doing something um, and I can never really have like this one to one thing. So, um, so the first thing update or the first thing I want to say really is thank you guys so much for all the support that you're showing me especially recently on my youtube channel um i currently just hit as of today 500 subscribers which is absolutely mental to me when i first started this youtube channel i generally did not think people would be interested um just watching me sew in my bedroom or just watching me trying to figure out what i want to do and um it turns out you guys are and a lot of you are giving me really really positive feedback on my videos um, a lot of you guys are saying that they are helping you um, which just means the world to me because that's what I want to do I want to teach people I want to help people with their craft and of course I don't know everything but what I do know I'm going to be sharing with you guys and so far loads of you have been finding it really helpful and you are learning stuff so that is the main goal and again I just want to say thank you guys so much for all the support both here on YouTube and also on my Instagram page page um it's just been amazing and i'm just really really grateful so i just want to get that out of the way and again a big thank you to every single one of you and now the biggest update i want to give you guys is i am actually currently working on a massive project that is being vlogged it will the vlog or the video will come out once it is all done um i did post something on my instagram story the other day some of you guys may have figured it out what it is what i'm actually doing is as you guys know i have kind of just finished my sewing space in my bedroom. Uh, my last video, I give you guys a full tour, put my last pegboards and everything. Um, but one thing I've always said to you guys and also to like my friends and family is this space is really, really small. Um, I, I can't cut fabric and I can't make patterns because I do not have the table space. Or I don't even have the floor space. Um, so I just have nowhere, even in the entire house, even the dining room table, it's just not, it's just not there. It's like not big enough and it's also always being used. Um, so I needed my own space and for months and months and months I've been nagging my parents to let me put some sort of workshop or some sort of design studio in the garden. Um, they've keep, they kept putting it off, putting it off, but then um, a couple of months ago they actually decided themselves to redo the back garden, like refurbish it. Um, so I, I knew that if I was to get a workshop this would be the perfect time and um, I spoke to them about it we sat down we talked about it and they agreed um, so I am going to be getting my very own design studio which is really really exciting and I'm really excited for um, so I will post the picture here of what I put up on Instagram the other day and then I also post a picture here of what my design studio will look like um, so as you guys can see by that picture um, it's really really nice actually it's gonna have a lot of natural light in there it's really big it's like a much bigger space it's basically it's about the size of my bedroom like my bedroom now is I measured it and it's I think it's like a foot small a foot bigger than the actual space so um, I'm really excited to have that hopefully it will be completed um, by the end of April so what we've done so far is we've put the concrete slab um, down where the shed is going to go and I have ordered a custom size shed or workshop um, for my local um, shed business which are really really good um, and that is coming in the second week it's coming on the 16th of April um, so I ordered that and now we guess we just kind of prep in the garden and things um, we're gonna have electricity in there I'm gonna insulate it, I'm gonna put wood floor in um, it's gonna be like a proper like outhouse I guess you could say um, and I'm really really excited for that because one thing I've always wanted is my own space um, a lot of times because I do everything in my bedroom and of course currently here in Wales we are in lockdown and it's March tomorrow so because I've been stuck in my room not in my room but like stuck in the house and I do all my uni work for my room I sleep in my room like everything is done here um, it's kind of been really hard for me to unwind and de-stress because university is stressful because I like to do a lot of work because I do like to get good grades um, so I don't really feel like I've had that space to really have like my um, creative process my design process and what I like to do and then that separation between um, like that and home because we've been in lockdown and um, so whereas when I was in university I'd go to uni everything would happen there I'd come home do a few things but I was like separated 
Whereas now everything's coming to one and it can be really difficult at times. So I'm really excited just for that aspect of having my own space. Um, it's going to be much more freer for me. It's going to be much more um, calming. And when I'm feeling stressed or in the house, I will be able to go out into the garden, into my own space. Um, which So then I think it'll give me like a sense of actually going somewhere else to work. Which for me personally is a much better feeling. Um, like Even if it was just a set of a room in the house, like it would be much better better but because like I said everything's in my bedroom um, it's just kind of difficult so um, don't get me wrong I'm really grateful for the space I have and I'm still gonna use it like my domestic machine and everything is staying here I'm gonna buy an industrial for my um, design studio um, but yeah that is the biggest update I wanted to give you guys and of course that is all being filmed behind the scenes and that video will come out once it's done um, it'll be a few separate videos um, but yeah that is the biggest update I wanted to give you guys and also I just wanted to ask you guys how you are um, let me know down below how you are if you're working on anything if you're working on any sewing projects or even anything else let me know below and also what I wanted you guys to do was um, comment down below what video ideas or what videos you want to see from me I have a lot planned I have a big list on my phone um, but of course if I can make videos that you guys specifically want that would be much better to you guys and much more beneficial so let me know down below what videos you want to see and I will 100% get them done um, and again all the feedback you guys have been giving me it's just been amazing and I'm really really grateful for every single one of you um, and yeah I just wanted to sit down today and give you guys an update on things I have been trying to film a lot of videos um, I've been trying to film one today but for some reason it's just not going right um, I think it's because I have a presentation due Wednesday for uni and it's like a formal assessment so um, I'm kind of stressing about that um, I've got a lot of it done but I like to make sure that it's done properly I need to do all my notes for it and everything um, so that is like my main focus right now but um, I've got like the bulk of my uni work done um, for this semester so far so I need to um, because I am like really up to date I'm not behind I can actually focus on YouTube more um, so what I'm going to be doing over the next week or two I'm going to be filming a lot of videos in advance and then I'm going to be scheduling them um, so then that way I'm not filming like on a weekly basis so I don't feel as stressed if that makes sense um, so that is my plan. So yeah, that is just the updates I wanted to give you guys. Again, I'm really, really excited for the future now and um, things that I want to plan and make. I've been making um, my own designs for things I want to make. Again, video ideas I've got written down, but please let me know down below what you want to see. And um, thank you guys for all the support and watching me. It really does mean the world. Like I said, when I first started this YouTube channel, I generally did not think that people would watch me. But now I'm almost at, um, now I'm at 500 subscribers. I just want to keep going and going because um, it's amazing it's not about the numbers or anything I generally do love what I do and I just want to share that with people um, but of course when people do watch me and that of course it's going to inspire me and motivate me just that little bit more so thank you guys so much for watching this video just like all my other ones any video ideas please comment down, down below also be sure to subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't already be sure to hit that bell notification icon next to the subscribe button so you get notified every single time I upload a brand new video and also be sure to follow me down on my instagram page which is daniel ryan design um and that is linked down below and if you guys want to check out any of my other links they're all also linked down below as well um so yeah again thank you guys so much for watching this video um i really hope you enjoyed this little update um again let me know down below what you guys think and what you want to see from me and what you're up to what you're making and um yeah again thank you guys so much and i will see you in my next video bye guys